Yeah. Free beer and hot wings in the morning. Grand Rapids rocks all day. 97.9 GRD rocks. 97.9 GRD rocks. Light showers early. Yeah, that's probably not accurate. It's Just showers. Good looking right now. I know that. Yeah. Uh, looking yeah. good. Yeah. High of 52 Gross. today. Uh, I'm not sure we got the break in the rain that we were hoping for, or maybe we're promised. Uh,. Maybe, maybe for one second today. Now it Thursday, wasn't misting. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, tomorrow is uh, rain will start at like 10 a.m. and be light rain throughout the day. Yeah, no big 48. deal. No big and deal at all. What shouldn't keep you in. Thursday, um, yeah, it looks like sunny and 80. Yeah, for the opening day with the West oh Michigan Whitecaps. Oh my White gosh, Caps. that's amazing! Uh, just you just oh, gotta no, find no, no. that uh, says percent chance of snow. Yeah, after eighty, it actually is. <laughs> it actually is an eighty percent chance of yeah. snow. Uh, yeah. Three to six inches of accumulation possible. Now that's not going to stop us. Oh, Joe and I will boy. be out at Elk Brewing from four until six, presumably before the first pitch of the Whitecaps season. Yeah, at Fifth Third Ballpark. I assume it'll go off without a hitch. Either way, you can still come to Elk Brewing and then. Go to Whitecaps. Go to go to Fifth Third. Yes. Eat hot dogs. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You'll so, be happy uh, from drinking craft beers and tasting some of the delicious things on their new menu. I'm gonna eat a lot. Yeah. Hey, I'm I'm too. That already. Mm-hmm. So that That's is Thursday. Plan. Joe and I'll be at Elk Brewing, 400 Dodge Street, Comstock Park, it's just down the so street nice. from Fifth Third. I might walk That'll there. Be fun. I'm certain you'll walk home. I'm certain I'll walk home too. <laughs> yeah. Nobody's giving you a ride. <laughs> nope. <laughs> that wasn't how I meant it. Yeah. <laughs> but it was how it sounded. Yeah, it is. Uh, did you see uh, Wood TV announced yesterday that uh, they are partnering with the Graham? They are going to move downtown to, like, where they have the uh, Art Prize Studios every year? I think it that's ma- awesome. It makes sense it really because uh, it seems like lately it has been more of a permanent structure anyway. Like when there are a lot of times when you come in in the morning, if there's anything going on, mm-hmm. or maybe they're doing work at their other studio or whatever, but there will be people down there, and there's like big screens in there that are not when Art Prize is going. I think on. it looks yeah. really cool. Um, I it think I think awesome. they go down there for all the events. I think um, when Laugh Fest was happening, they had stuff going on yeah. down there. I go, why not? No, that I was the Laugh Fest well. store, but. But you, yes, other than that, they're always over there. Do you think yeah, people will be closer to us. start loitering outside like the yes. Today Show? Yes. They uh, do it now. Yeah. Anytime there's lights there, it always amazes Actually, me that it can be 5 o'clock in the morning, and there are people standing around, and that, like I said, there are times where they're broadcasting down there that there isn't something going on. No, that's during Art Prize, typically. That's during, no, those but, are special no, times. But I, mean, I think people no, get used I'm to I'm serious. It. When nothing is going on, not during Art Prize, they've been down there like uh, like a month ago. They, yeah. they're, the TV cameras were on and stuff, and there were people standing around. But you I'm give like, it what time, are you doing? People get used to it, I think. Yeah. Probably, yeah, but even so, I know some people Chicago, just like to try to get their faces on TV. I don't understand it. I've never understood that. I but yeah, no, you're right. Like, Hi. People do love that. They really do. Well, I've they love I've it been there. so much. Lindsay Lohan Freedom Trip. I've felt that. Yeah, I felt that power that comes with being on television. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, intoxicating, especially yeah. when you're there to ruin someone's day. But that's most of it. You know. Yeah. Like, that's the fun of it. But no, no people, we don't have a Gretchen Carlson here. People get used to it, but still, it is cool. There's nothing like that around. It's something different, and it's a space that is prominent. And yeah. Why not? It deserves to have something that, I don't know, people can at least gawk at for one second. Yeah, I think it's cool. I like it and stuff downtown. Kidding. If it was the other way around, if it was them talking about us going there, I'd be excited. Oh, oh yeah. Sure. Ground floor studio that. where we could watch people? That would be very, very sure, it's cool. very inexpensive. And they sent that email out saying, hey, does anyone want this space? We should have done it. Yeah. Yeah. Instead of saying no, no, <laughs> we're happy looking at the butt of your building. Yeah, the part that looks like it should have a facade on it but doesn't. We're yeah. That is that remains one of the great disappointments of the construction boom downtown is the fact that uh, yes, they didn't build the museum as we would like it from our view from the window. They well, didn't finish it. Literally, every other side that is on that building looks. Awesome. Yeah. And there's something cool to look at. Mm-hmm. We got the back. It just always Ours felt, looks like an yeah. unfinished basement. It does. It always felt and still feels like there should have been some sort of panels attached to the side. But it's the back of the building. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just doesn't matter to them. Yeah. So Saturday but night will okay. be the uh, 
the fourth, fourth, fifth live at night show. Fifth. Yeah. The live third, at night show. The third, third at DeVos. Third at DeVos, yeah. We're, we've done it twice then before that at the intersection. First right? was intersection, then orbit room, then three at yeah. DeVos. Yeah. And so you can still get your tickets, WGRD.com, DeVos Performance Hall. There aren't many, though. Dot com. There are I don't no, remember not the orbit room, orbit room one at all. I don't remember a thing about it. I Steve remember. met Annette, Annette there. Oh, I remember mm-hmm. that. That was pretty big. Yep. Yeah. That's right. Uh, that was the oh. first time we did instant feedback, <gasps> but we couldn't hear the I audio remember. of us on the stage, which the, is a pretty uh, hard deal when I, you'd have to listen to the other people and respond to them. Yeah, I yeah. blocked it was, out. That's what the issue is. Yeah, there the, was uh, there weren't any monitors, and uh, we couldn't hear anything. It was that was tough. I don't think any. I don't think people in the audience knew. Um, because the the show still went. No, fine. they definitely did. Oh, there did was they? One, there man, was one we segment couldn't hear anything though. Where we had all of those men on the street interviews that th- Joe and I spent hours recording. Yeah, and then when we played them, it was like somebody went over and just cranked up the bass knob on the, yeah, on the sound mixing board. Yeah, because every time somebody would talk, it was. Yeah, that was a huge disappointment. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean to everybody, not just us. We yeah. did the work for it, mm-hmm. but. It wasn't entertaining to the audience. You guys weren't entertained by it because no one could hear it. I yeah, still I remember because I remember Joe saying, like yelling at the sound guy, saying like, "Jesus, dude, it's not a bassy Cadillac." <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah, ease up on the bass. <laughs> wow, good. Well, those problems will not be had at DeVos Performance. No, no that's no. a bit of a cumbersome insult. Definitely but. not. <laughs> it's true. Um, that moment walking out on the stage at DeVos. I mean, selfishly. It's as good as it gets. It's for ridiculous. This business. Yes. Uh, so it we, really is. We appreciate everybody who's gotten tickets so far. We look forward to seeing you Saturday night. We've worked uh, pretty hard on coming up with a plan that we are uh, pretty com- Yesterday, we had to talk about making cuts. Yeah. And I, I felt great driving home because I'm like, we just had to cut stuff that I think is a win if we keep it in. Like, if we had time to do more. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think those are wins. Yeah, of segments that we had to cut. That's a good feeling. Yeah, if it you're feels going, good when, you, when you're cutting a bits. If you're going on Saturday too, don't be late. No, no. want to be no, there. Don't be late in your seat. The show starts at eight, and you need to be in your seat at eight. Get in and get your beer as soon as possible. We're but gonna yeah, start. Sit down and enjoy the show from the second it starts. Mm-hmm. I'm it, it doesn't run late, and we don't start late. For once. Mm-hmm. Oh, for once, yeah, but yeah, it's only because once. we can't there. Yeah, yeah we have to. We have yeah, to keep things. Yeah, we have. A, there's a hard out time. Timely. Yeah, you know, it's like dealing with a local ordinance. Sometimes, like for the ballpark or whatever, it's like, okay, well, if the game runs long, we only have till this time to yeah. have fireworks because people live in the area. DeVos is the same. It's like you got to be out by this time, and that's that, man. The mm-hmm. sound goes down. They shut the power off. Last year, uh, as we were winding down, I, I kept looking at my watch. Because I'm conscious of that. Yeah. And uh, I got a really angry email the next day. Like, literally, like that person oh, sent it at like yeah, they four did. in the morning. Yeah, had a great time, but I couldn't help notice Freebear wanted to be someone else because he couldn't stop looking at his watch the last. I suppose that might be what you're thinking. And uh, someone who was a more seasoned stage performer would have been better at sneaking peeks or looking not every 30 seconds like I was. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, yeah, but, but even yeah. so, I mean, you know, I guess. To each their own to interpret it that way. It seems, I mean, I when, seem you've been, when you've been on the stage for two hours and 15 minutes, uh, at that point you go, all right, well, maybe it's because they wonder what time it is because they have to wrap it up. Yeah. I know we were having fun. So mm-hmm. Oh, we had a blast. If you they could, they if kept coming out. <laughs> people were letting that out bother going, you. Hey, guys, you got to, listen, you got to wrap it up. I kept getting, yeah, I was getting out because Angela is the one. Here on our end, who coordinates everything with DeVos. Yeah, get mad at her. Yeah. Does, no, don't get mad at her. I'm just does kidding, <laughs> obviously. All of the behind the scenes stuff. So she'd be like, all right, 15 minutes, 12 minutes, eight minutes, guys, three minutes. Guys, if you're two not minutes done, and 48 seconds. I swear to God, they're going to shut the power off. <laughs> We're going to be trapped in here. That would be amazing. <laughs> we'll just go all night then. Yeah, let's make the goal. Yeah. Make them kill the power. Yeah, it's not the goal. No, we're they won't kill the power. They're not going to kill. No, you no, they'll time kill. Time and a half at that point. Are you yeah. Ki- yeah, no, they'll kill us. They're union. Yeah, they don't put um, up with that. Yeah, and then you'll never find us. No, no. Anyway, if you're gonna, if you're gonna letting zone. that little piece of the end, which was all in your mind, ruin that show for you, as we're dumb. Mm-hmm. We have a don't pair of tickets come. to the live at night show. Let's go, caller seven. We do. 
Yeah, 770-WGRD or 1-800-947-3979. Call now. Pair of tickets for you. Anything else? No. I mean, uh, I thought of some news that I could make up because we were looking through the news. Wasn't a lot going on. I said, we'll just make it up. Mm -hmm. But I don't feel comfortable doing that. Mm -hmm. I can't wait till we get done so you can tell me what you were going to yeah, who are you I'm going? Who all, you were going to disparage? Well, fun, fun news. I don't know if you heard, but there was a mysterious murder in town last night. Ooh. There was. Yeah, mm. someone prominent is possibly involved. <laughs> oh yeah. So you're not disparaging anyone specifically. No. But a lot of people could be potentially disparaged. Wonder. Wow. Do you think we'll find out who it was? I'll tell you. Does the motive make sense? What song do we have to cut to? To listen to while Lincoln I tell Park, you. Uh, no, it's either day. No, no, no. Can Come you please on, guys, play tubular Tuesday. bells? <laughs> no, okay. I cannot. This is good then. It's either remedy. 979 GRD Rock.